What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and man, this entire week has been tease after tease for the next big update for Call of Duty Black Ops 4, which is set to come out next week on Tuesday the 11th, and today we got some more details on what's going to be coming, and that was in the form of a teaser for a new specialist, and I have the little video playing in the background, and this was tweeted out over on the PlayStation Twitter account, and the title says the the disruption is coming now as for who this character is it's pretty hard to make out because all we can see is someone holding on to some type of a grenade but clearly on the grenade we see a little logo which I assume is the logo for the specialist character whoever it may be to me I feel this grenade will kind of act like an EMP and disable any electronic equipment or score streak within its radius or I think it's going to be a smoke grenade. We don't have smokes in Black Ops 4 multiplayer, however, we do have them in Blackout. But again, as for who this character is, that remains a mystery. I do have some theories which I want to share with you guys, but before I explain, allow me to give you some context. So. On the map frequency, there's a building right in front of the spawn here, and in this building are these TV screens with information about some of the specialists in Black Ops 4. Now, there are three TV screens that are kind of glitched or broken, but there are some words we can make out on the screen right next to Ruin and Seraph. I'm going to have it on for you guys right here, and the few words kind of line up with the tweet from PlayStation, and the words are Anarchist, System Intrusion, Berlin Subculture, Constantly Moving, Limited Digital Footprint, and then Black Hat Hacker with a history of large-scale politically motivated pranks. So with that, here are my two theories. The first one I think is Spectre or Jason Mason Green. If you played the Specialist campaign, one of the popular theories is she is Spectre because after getting shot in the mouth from a rogue operation gone wrong, she now has a voice box that kind of makes a voice similar to the robotic sound that Spectre has. Of course, in Black Ops 3, there were a little bits of clues and hints that made it seem like Spectre was indeed a female, so... I think this character could very well be Spectre and the grenade from the video will be a smoke grenade leaving her specialist weapon to be the Ripper. The smoke grenade could maybe replace active camo because there were a lot of people who hated this ability especially in the competitive scene back three years ago. The smoke grenade kind of acts similar in terms of concealment and stealth wise but except the player just doesn't turn invisible. We also do see Jessica Mason I guess hack into ruins hideout and on his TV she warns him about the oncoming raid and then Ruin meets Jessica where she is surrounded by a bunch of advanced technology so I do feel she is definitely a plausible theory the second theory I have is Blackjack because Blackjack was actually able to hack other specialist weapons or abilities but I don't think we will be getting this character anytime soon I definitely do think he's coming but I don't know to me I just feel like now is not the time for him plus I just really couldn't come up with any idea for what that grenade could be for him so um, blackjack he maybe would be coming to black ops 4 but I just don't feel this character in the video lines up with him my final theory is someone who was never a specialist in black ops 3 but she was a campaign character from black ops 2 and that is Chloe Lynch aka Karma now Karma was known for her ability to hack and decode hidden information she was also working for Menendez but then she switched sides and started working for the joint special operation command which which kind of lines up with the anarchist part on the TV screen. Also, she does pretty much fit that Berlin subculture theme because she does kind of rock that gothic steampunk theme. Um, so yeah, I do feel she's another plausible character. And then as for that grenade, I feel it could be an EMP grenade where it disables any type of electronic a piece of equipment like say the Mantis or the sensor dart, etc. So those are my three theories on who I think the specialist character could be. 
that was revealed to us yesterday. Now, as for another topic I want to talk about, which is DLC 1, I do feel we are going to be getting this DLC next week. Um, there has been a lot of leaks in regards to zombies. There's been like a bunch of new characters that have been leaked out, and uh, even the map name for the zombies um, DLC 1. I'm not going to show any of that for you guys because, of course, it was leaked information. It's not supposed to go out, but I will link a video down below in the description in case you guys want to go check that out. So I do feel we are on the verge of a new DLC coming along with this new specialist character plus the new addition to the Blackout Battle Royale map, which is Hijacked. If you guys didn't know, Hijacked is going to be coming kind of further out past Nuketown, but a little bit in the middle of the construction site. So, um, yeah, that's something to look out for for all you Blackout players. Plus, I do feel that next week is going to be the new operation for Black Ops 4. Um, I think it will be Christmas themed because, of course, December is here and uh, Christmas is coming up very, very soon. And, you know, people just love Christmas. So I've, every year there's also been like a Christmas event for Call of Duty. So I don't see why they would not do one for this year. And yeah, next week, guys, like I said, a bunch of new updates are going to be coming out. Um, new stuff, new content. I am so, so excited. Tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments. Also, drop a like on the video if you guys did enjoy. And also, let me know who you think that new specialist character could be. Do you think it's one of the characters I listed? Or possibly someone totally new. Just maybe someone we've never, ever heard of or seen before in the Black Ops universe. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I love you all so, so much. Till next time, I'll see you later.